Hey there my beautiful people, I hope you all are doing well. In today's video, I am giving you some tips that I feel could be beneficial to anyone looking to create a positive and relaxing atmosphere in their bedroom. With these simple tips, you can use them as you see fit in your own bedroom. As we start this video, I would like to put a small disclaimer before we start. These are all just tips. I don't want anyone to feel any way if you cannot incorporate these tips in your own bedroom. Of course, we all live different lives. This and all of my videos are just here to give you some motivation and inspiration to use as you see fit in your own home. Okay? Okay. As you can see, I'm just dusting my room. I'll also be vacuuming. When dusting your bedroom, it improves the air quality. Cleaning will ensure that you have removed the air of dust particles and allergens. Being able to breathe in a clean, fresh room will most definitely lead to a better night's sleep. When keeping your most sacred space clutter free, you are reducing mental and physical stressors. Try keeping clutter piled up in your bedroom down to a minimum. If you can, go through your things and declutter. If you haven't worn or used something in the last six months, either donate or just throw it in the trash. And no, I'm not talking about your shorts or your swimsuit that you haven't worn because it's winter time. I mean those jeans or t-shirts you have in your closet that you haven't worn since high school. It's time to give it up, okay pumpkin? Okay. Also, keep kids' toys out of your bedroom. I have a strict rule on no toys in our room. My bedroom is not a playroom. My daughter has her own room where she is able to play with all of her toys as much as she wants in her own bedroom. If you can and if your schedule allows it, try making your bed as often as you can. Making my bed is not only enjoyable, but it increases the productivity. It's the first task that you complete for the morning, which will promote you being more productive throughout the day. Also, be more mindful of keeping your linen and your bedding clean at least once a week is ideal. When decorating your bedroom, use colors that make you happy. I prefer calm, soothing colors for a relaxing atmosphere, but of course choose colors that personally suit your style. For a list of calming bedroom colors, I will have them listed linked down below in the description box. your bedroom smelling good also helps create a relaxing and calm vibe. Spraying air fresheners, room sprays, lighting candles, using plug-ins, or even the oil diffusers will all promote a good smelling bedroom. Try to keep an open and positive flow throughout your bedroom. Avoid using oversized furniture in smaller spaces and overcrowding your bedroom with unnecessary items. Now I know and understand a lot of us are working from home so doing your work in your bedroom is really the only space you have, especially since a lot of the kids are still doing virtual learning. If possible, try moving your office into another quiet area in your home. You don't want to associate your place of work with your place of rest. This can cause some major distractions on relaxing and those intimate moments. If your bedroom is the only alternative space, try placing your desk opposite the bed. And if possible, try to avoid working on your bed. Another tip on creating a relaxing and calm bedroom is to have a reading area. It can include a comfy oversized chair, floor pillows, a carpet, or even a small couch. Decorate it with some greenery, a candle, and find a lamp for a nice calming vibe. Choosing simple and minimum decor pieces makes your room look and feel spacious, which enhances the feeling of tranquility and peace. Of course, choose pieces that are meaningful to you and your personal style. Why not 
to do chores or projects in your room. For me, I do fold my laundry on my bed. My laundry room is right in the hallway and I'm definitely not going all the way downstairs just to fold laundry, just to bring it back up. That's just not happening. But if your space allows it, maybe completing the folding and ironing process in another room. I do like to make sure that all of my laundry is immediately put away and all of the clutter and clothes are just not hanging around. Also, limiting your TV time is also a way to create a relaxing vibe, but honestly for me, watching my favorite shows snuggled up in my bed is sometimes most relaxing. On those days where I don't want to watch TV or I'm just reading, I will put on a relaxing screensaver on my television to create a more peaceful atmosphere. So this concludes this video on tips on how to make your bedroom feel more relaxing and peaceful. I hope you were able to get some inspiration from this video. And like I stated earlier, I understand incorporating all of these tips may be challenging, but hopefully you were able to take something by watching today. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a happy thumbs up. Leave a comment down below on ways you'd like to keep your bedroom calm and relaxing. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing. My name is Le'Veon with Extremely Modest and I enjoy posting motivational cleaning, home decor, and organization videos. If this type of content keeps your interest, please consider subscribing. Thank you all for spending some time with me today, and until next video, guys, bye-bye. One man's trash is another man's baggage Slow you down, I ain't going nowhere Space suit on, can't breathe this air TNT going off in here Ain't we up there? Cause you always wanna touch me My phones will leave you bleeding That's why I'm always leaving Cause you always wanna touch me My phones will leave you bleeding That's why I'm always leaving Believe me One more shot, one more round Take my hits, pound for pound Promise I'll let you down One more round Don't step on my rose Pounds Don't step on my rose Pounds Me. Situations left you lonely. Try to give you my best shot, but my best don't mean a lot. Bullseye always miss that spot. It's all I got. Cause you always wanna touch me. My phones will leave you bleeding. That's why I'm always leaving. Cause you always wanna touch me My phones will leave you bleeding That's why I'm always leaving Believe me, believe me oh, One more shot, one more foul Take my hits, pound for pound Promise I'll let you down
you fall 